Welcome again on this beautiful day. Uh, good morning, good evening, good afternoon to all of you. Thank you for joining um, this series of webinars by Gorkham. And today's webinar topic is Understanding Basic TRIPS Report. My name is Ekaterina Kim. I'm a Partner Success Manager in Gorkham. Today, we will cover the basics of TRIPS reports in our agenda is to outline the following three things. First one is four types of TRIPS reports. Four types of TRIPS reports, um, how to create a report and how to execute and export um, reports. So let's get started. As we know, there are four types of, sorry, it's just some mismatch. Four types of TRIPS reports um, for unit, for unit groups, and our new feature that we rolled out a couple of months ago, the TRIPS report for driver and groups of drivers, and you can see in this screenshot. Um, I must notice that um, our screenshots and uh, theoretical part will be joined by a practical part, so um, stay tuned. Um, so next step, actually, how to create a report. In Violon, in your monitoring panel, you first open the reports tab, and then you click this new button in order to create a new report. Your next step would be to name a report template um, as you want, um, and then choose the report type. For this exercise, I choose um, the unit group uh, to show you how to um, create the report for a unit group. And your next step would be to press a new table button uh, in order to start the actual creation. And when you click the next um, new table, next part would be to select table type trips. As the topic of this webinar is trips uh, report uh, reports. So we select trips and then you select necessary columns. And as a reminder, trips report is this kind of report that shows the intervals of movements with the indication of time, location, and other parameters such as speed, mileage, duration, and many others. For my screenshot, I choose these ones, but again, it's up to you um, what kind of columns to choose based on your needs. And our next step when we um, uh, have this part is go into the settings tab and select these following columns, utilization, raw numbering, and total. And this total option adds the last line, which contains the resulting data, the total duration of all trips, the total, um, the total mileage, etc. And again, I will show you on our practice exercise. And then you click OK. And then, we created our report. But also the main idea of the report is actually to execute the report and see the data and then export it to um, formats that is um, good for you. In order to execute the report, again, you're coming back to a report tape on um, Bialon monitoring uh, panel. You select the report template. Assuming you have many more templates, um, you select trips report and then you select an object. An object can be a unit, a unit group, etc. Then you select the interval of time for um, what period of time you want to run this report for. And then you click an execute button. And uh, you will have the report with the following settings 
um, depend on the period of time you executed it for. And for um, exporting options, you have two main options uh, to choose from, either PDF or Excel file. And when you click on it, your report will be exported into your laptop or computer. So that's the theoretical part, how it looks like on screenshots. Uh, and uh, we actually want to show you the practice time to see how it looks like on real time. And before showing and creating the report from scratch for you guys, I already created uh, three types of reports um, for a unit, for a unit group, and for a driver. And again, I will show you how to create a report for a group of drivers. So before that, let's quickly go through some reports and see how they actually look like in real time. So trips report for a unit. I want to see the report for a yesterday. And I executed my report. I select this um, object or a unit. I select the interval of time, yesterday. If you select a week, it will run the report for a previous week. And the same goes for a month. So that's this um, peculiar moment you have to remember. In order to run for the current week or current months, you have to click include in current. So that's how report looks like for a unit, uh, showing uh, where the trip began, began, where it ended, its initial location and final location. An interesting part, you can also see it on the map. That's the initial location. And that's the final location of this particular trip. And then you can see the duration, the total duration of, um, of trips showing here for 42 minutes and the total mileage also with a breakdown for every single trip for this particular unit. And we're coming back to reports templates and we see uh, we, we are checking trips report for a unit group. I already have uh, a unit group I called out of lead group. Um, and I want to run this report, let's say for a week. Or maybe for a month. And you see right now I have two units on my report. And again, I see the initial location, final location, and the duration of all trips. If I want to see more detailed information, I can click here and can see every single trip that happened in February for this particular unit. And same goes for a different unit as well. So that's how it looks like. And what about driver? The trips report for driver is the same. You click on the report. Um, you clean, click driver, you click for a report. I have two drivers, um, Julia Roberts and Tom Cruise. And I wanna see where Julia Roberts went Let's say yesterday. She did not go anywhere yesterday, maybe for a week. Yep. For a week, she was driving for a total of five hours and 138 miles. So that's how the report looks for a driver. And the most interesting part, actually how to create a report for a group of drivers. Uh, just a sneak peek, I already have uh, my group of drivers, my celebrity drivers and my Marvel comic character drivers um, on the groups. So we're coming back and report. And remember, we are on this reports tab. We are clicking next. Oh, new, sorry. And then we name our report. Trips report group of 
tires. And we select the type, and here we go, group of drivers. We click next table, new table. And here we select the type is trips. Again, different options. Today we are covering trips. And we also choose in columns. The beginning, the end. And in order for you to make it more logical, you can actually move this closer, beginning, end, initial location, final location. You can move it closer. Then you want to have the duration. And maybe we need to find mileage. Do we have a mileage here? Yes, we do. And mileage. And then um, you see this gap. If you won't check those buttons, uh, it does not mean that in our report we will have these unchecked buttons. The report automatically or logically will put everything together, together that is checked. But we can do it ourselves as well. Duration, let's leave mileage like this. And next step was go to settings. And on settings, I want to make a digitalization or grouping rather by a driver to see uh, all my drivers. And here we go. It automatically goes as a driver and you can click add. And next step would be add digitalization, raw numbering and the total. And we click OK, and we click OK one more time. And in our report templates right now, we have group of drivers. Let's see how it looks like. Trips report, group of drivers. I have two groups. I wanna, drive, I wanna run the report on celebrity drivers. For the past week, okay. And for the past week, I see that total of three drivers were working. And then I can also see who, who was the hardworking driver. And in this case, Tom Cruise, six days. Wow, I have a really hardworking driver. And then um, you can see Julia Roberts next, drove five hours and Dwayne Johnson just for 10 minutes. And when you click on this plus button, you can see the details of the trip, where exactly these drivers had their trips, what did they do every single time. So that's how the reports are working, and that's our practical time. And the next step, would be actually to execute the, uh, to export the report. Um, let's say you need to show it to, uh, to somebody and we can actually click to export a PDF. And I have my celebrity driver's report, click it here. And that's how it looks like on a PDF format. Trips, name, and the breakdown of every single driver. So Wayne Johnson, total duration, total mileage, Julia Roberts, so on and so forth. So that's how it looks like for an execution 